welcome back to another video everyone in today's video i am going to show you guys how to install dolby atmos on any android device uh, i think it's from android 4.4 and up so if you are within that range then you are in luck okay so i have here with me my fire hd 2018 um, of course it has dolby speakers um, of course the speakers work well with dolby um, but just that the app itself didn't come installed and also i have a customer but basically this is a general procedure so it's basically the same for everyone um, you'd be using of course twerp to do that or any other custom recovery um, or if you have a flash fire from uh, the developer chin fire then you can also use flash fire um, so yeah in my case i have two but ensure that you have a custom recovery all right so um Basically, what you need now is simply to download the Dolby files from the description. So I will have that in the description for you guys. So there will just be two files. Um, one file would be Dolby Audio, or of course Dolby Atmos. And um, the other file would be the uninstaller. So in the event that you'd like to um, uninstall it for some reason or the other, then you can feel free to do that. Um, also, actually three files. There would also be another file if your audio is a bit... Um, unstable then there will be another file that you would flash which would address um, some of some possible issues that you are experiencing so let's reboot into recovery so in my case that would be power and volume down or some of you power and volume up or if you are on Samsung then power home button and volume up okay so um, I have an advanced reboot option so since I have a custom ROM so basically uh, I can just make use of that so that's what i'm doing now to boot into recovery um, and i am going to flash dolby atmos so stay tuned for that all right so we are now entering twoop okay so and they'll definitely no data loss just keep that in mind no data loss guys um, so of course head over to install um, wherever you have it whether it be on your micro SD card or on your internal storage um, I'm guessing it might be in your internal storage in your downloads folder which is also in my case so I am going to select it the file would be DAP underscore um, R65 release 66.5 sorry <clears throat> so I'm going to select that and also you have the uninstaller if you'd like to uninstall it so I'm going to select this file and I'm going to swipe to flash. Uh, it's not too long though, so just basically a simple installation and um, it's done and now I'm going to reboot my system. Okay, and um, of course, after which I will show you the varying options that you have. Of course, you have a louder audio. So if your device previously um, had very terrible audio, then of course, look forward to that being enhanced. Now, I'm not saying that applies to every device out there. Um, I mean, if you have stereo speakers then of course you should enjoy the benefits of that um, Dolby Atmos and um, of course low audio would also be enhanced so you would have very loud audio rather loud audio if your music and then uh, if you're playing movies as well better sound effects with Dolby Atmos okay all right guys so now you should be greeted by a new app in your app drawer and as you can see here I have Dolby Atmos so it will open up in landscape so let me just turn my tablet and as you can see here we are on the control panel so of course you have volume leveler and you have dialogue enhancer and what this does is simply enhance uh, whether if it's let's say someone is uh, it's a movie you're watching and there are persons of course speaking then you would be the, the audio would basically be much better with dialogue in there you also have an option for gaming you can change that for gaming as well and music and movies and others you can also make your custom presets as well for the speakers uh, but I'm going to leave it as default I'm going to leave it on music alright so um, volume leveler and um, you can see now that I'm going to try increasing my volume I'm going to try to make it so that you guys can hear okay um, so it's basically pretty cool actually so let me try again ok 
you so i guess you can hear it um what i'm going to do now is try playing another a song or something let me find one so that i can play all right so i'm playing a song for what you guys in here Alright, so I guess you can tell the difference, the audio is a bit louder and also it's a bit better with regards to the output of the sound, the sound is very clean and of course that's what we're looking for in our audio. So um, also let me see what else I'm going to show you guys. Alright, so let me open up the app so you can, see, so you can actually see, uh, of course this is pretty cool and you can change your different options. So volume level actually increases the audio output. So as you can see, I turned it off and you'll see it right now. And take a look at what happens now. See the difference? Um, we have also virtualizer and we have movie, game. Okay, so yeah, that's basically it guys. So I trust that you will indeed helped by today's video. I trust that it worked out for you and of course, if it did, be sure to subscribe to my channel, hit thumbs up and share the video with others. I'll see you guys in another video.